welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an updated perfume collection video. This was a highly requested video by you guys, so I definitely wanted to give you guys what you want. Um, before I get started, I just want to show you guys my little Dora wig. It's definitely given Dora if you ask me, but I want to try like some different wigs for my channel, so let me know what you guys think down below. But She's definitely giving Dora if you ask me. <laughs> no further ado, let's just get on with the video. Please be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy and subscribe. We are almost at 2,000 subscribers. I'm honestly so excited to hit 2,000 subscribers. Like you guys are all my friends. You've been here since the beginning, back in high school when I was like making videos from my iPhone. Um, but anyways, I will be doing a giveaway when I hit 2,000 subscribers. So please subscribe, please like, show your cat, show your dog, show your cousin, show your friend, show your ex, show, show everyone my channel and show them my videos if you enjoy. But let's just get started. Okay guys, so this is my entire perfume collection. As you can see, I have a really good mixture of Bath & Body Works items as well as my own perfumes that I just purchased, but most of it is from Bath & Body Works, so let's just get started. I'm gonna be starting from the back going to the, I mean, from the left going to the right and the back to the front. So the first item that I have back here, I'm actually gonna show you guys my deodorant first. Um, I don't know, this isn't this isn't really a perfume, but I put it with, my, the, with the rest of my perfumes. So this is the Arm & Hammer Ultra Max, um, Deodorant in the scent powder fresh. I don't always use that deodorant, but I like to just switch it up depending on you know which ones are good. Then the pretty much the first item of my perfume collection is the pink watermelon 24 hour moisture ultra shea body cream. Um, this honestly smells so good. It's just a juicy watermelon scent. It also has sparkling water and sugared lemon. It is just the perfect scent for the summertime. After that, I also have Fiji Sunshine Guavatini. This is also in a 24 hour moisture shea body cream. And this one is definitely a tropical scent. So if you guys are into that, then highly, I highly recommend this scent. It just has um, sun kissed guava, oranges, and seaside jasmine. Right next to that, I have Frosted Coconut Snowball, and I think this um, scent is actually discontinued. Um, don't quote me on that, but this one honestly smells so good. This is a part of the like winter collection. I don't think they have this out now because summer is approaching us, but it smells like an island meets an igloo. And what I mean by that, it has vanilla, winter freesia, snow kisses, snow kiss woods and spun sugar and it smells so sweet it's coconut mixed with like a wintry type of frosted type of scent and that smells so delicious um right next to that i have raspberry tangerine and this one is not really one of my favorites but it smells very fruity so if you guys like fruity scents then definitely check this one out it's sweet, citrus, um, it has a citrus of raspberries, tangerine, and lemons. Moving forward, I'm going to be moving on to the body mist, I guess you can say, the fragrance mist from Bath & Body Works here. I have a lot of them. Um, I have two of the pink coconut calypso, and this, honestly, I have two, and one of them is actually running out because I was obsessed with this scent. And this smells so good, you guys. It just has um, a tropical blend of coconut water, seaside frieza, and sun lily, apple, and driftwood. And let me tell you guys, mm, that scent smells so good. If you love coconut, then definitely um, check that one out. Right next to that, um, I actually didn't show you guys this lotion, so I'm going to show you guys this. This is my all-time favorite lotion. This is Fresh Coconut Culotta. Um, 
I don't know if I told you guys about this one, but this one smells so good. It pretty much has um, coconut milk, vanilla rum, and pink hibiscus. So it's definitely, if you guys are a big fan of coconut, then definitely check this one out because mm, it smells so like warm and sweet. You're definitely going to be getting a lot of attention from that one. Right after that, I have Sunset Guava Culotta, and this one is, as you can see, is empty, but I kept the bottle because they don't sell this anymore. However, I still am on the lookout for this. They probably have it on Amazon for like <laughs> an arm and a leg, but I love to just smell it here and there, even though there's like a teensy bit left, but it smells so good. It just has um, like a sweet and sugary scent with a hint of coconut. Right next to that, we got Secret Wonderland. And this one, I'm gonna tell you guys, this one definitely is for those grown folks. Like if you grown and you're sexy and you wanna go out on a date, <laughs> let me stop. But this one definitely smells really grown and sexy. Like I said, um, sexy and seductive. It has white amber and sandalwood. So it's definitely, a nighttime scent you can definitely wear it on a date um, it's perfect for date night so I highly recommend that one as well um, we're gonna move on to over here I have um, Bora Bora citrus no sorry we're gonna go over here so right here is my Kapari coconut body glow and this isn't a perfume however I keep it with the rest of my perfumes because it is kind of like a you know body item that you can put on with your lotion and stuff but it just smells like coconut it just has gold glitter in it and it's just like a body glow to put on in the summertime um and it's made with real coconut as well coconut oil next i have fiji guava fiji sunshine guavatini sorry guys and this one this is just in a fine fragrance mist and this smells so good. I already described this scent, so I'm just going to skip over it, but I did want to show you guys that I do have it in the Fine Fragrance Mist. Next, I have Bora Bora Citrus Surf, and this one definitely smells like a crisp citrus scent. It has sugared lemon, water fruit, and vanilla, so if you guys like a, like a kind of like fresh scent, um, more so than a coconut or, or sweet scent, then I de definitely recommend um, Bora Bora. Next, I got Sparkling Peach Sangria, and this is your perfect combination of like peaches and champagne. Like, it's so sweet, but it definitely just gives you like a little bit of sexy because it has that kind of champagne um, scent to it. Next, we got Watermelon Lemonade, which is what I described to you guys already. Um, so you guys already know what that smells like. Um, I do want to talk to you guys about these Hawaiian Tropic um, fragrance mist. And you guys are probably like, doesn't Hawaiian Tropic like only sell like, you know, um, tanning lotion and, you know, body um, sun sunscreen and stuff like that. But no, they also make fragrance mist and I was so excited to see this at Marshalls and Burlington because I um, you know saw these and they smell so good you guys the scent honestly lasts so long I'm honestly blown away but this one is in the scent golden paradise and this of course um, it has a warm sand and creamy coconut type of scent to it so it smells so good um, and it really does last long, all day. I also have it in Island Resort, and this one is more of a fruity kind of floral um, scent. Definitely perfect for going on vacation. Um, but like I said, highly recommend these. Like these, the quality of these Hawaiian Tropic Body um, Fragrance Mists are honestly just as good as Bath & Body Works, if not better. So highly recommend these. I'm definitely gonna be getting more um, moving on we got over here is my juicy couture Malibu surf 
perfume and this honestly smells really good. It has a fresh and exotic and floral scent. It's definitely perfect for a beach day. It's really fresh and perfect to put on when you're going, um, you know, to a beach or a lake or something. I don't really know. I have my Onika Nicki Minaj perfume. This was um, in my other perfume collection videos and you guys loved it it honestly and this honestly just smells sweet and sexy it has pear star fruit orange orchid and water water lily and um musk as well oh i totally forgot to show you guys bora 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 is um pretty much i just have it in a body lotion but i already described to you guys what that smells like so i'm just gonna move on right here i have my dkny um, be delicious um, perfume and it just looks like this it is in a like an apple type of form which is honestly the cutest thing ever <laughs> it just has a really nice mouth-watering fresh citrus scent with apples and sparkling grapefruit we also have um, my Nicki Minaj pink Friday perfume definitely very sweet se sexy seductive very similar to the Anika over here. However, this one just doesn't have that type of coconut type of um, tropical scent to it. It's more so girly. It's definitely giving like Ariana vibes, like Ariana Grande vibes. Um, you know, if you ever tried any Ariana Grande's um, perfumes, it definitely smells similar. So yeah, very sweet and sexy and feminine as well. Um, we also got this little guy right here. And this one is the Perry Ellis 360 Coral Perfume. Very flirty. It's very flirty and feminine. It does have Italian bergamot, sparkling peaches, and Asian apple. And it is a more groaner scent. So if you guys are a little bit, you know, you know, you groan or whatever, <laughs> then definitely check out this scent. I got a little sample here and I don't know what this is for. This is Angels Only and this is by Victoria's Secret. Um, I don't really use this so I don't really even know how to describe that scent but we're just gonna keep on moving forward. Right here is um, Pink Sugar by Aqualina. It's a vanilla and like cotton candy super sweet scent like honestly out of all of my perfumes this one is the most like it smells so sweet like it brings me back to my childhood that's how sweet it is um so if you guys are into that then i highly recommend getting this one and then last but not least is tommy girl and this is just what the bottle looks like pretty sleek clean um i was about to say clear <laughs> this is not a cover girl um commercial but this honestly just smells really refreshing and energetic it has black currant, mandarin oranges, and apple tree blossom. So perfect for like, you know, I can imagine someone that's like going to the outlets, shopping, having a nice, you know, you know, day shopping on a shopping spree wearing this scent. So yeah. So that was pretty much my entire perfume collection. I'm going to show you guys everything and kind of zoom out. And this is just what I keep everything on. This little perfume tray, it's actually not a perfume tray. I believe it's just a tray that you keep, you know, honestly anything on. You're, you can put it on your vanity. You can put it, you know, um, you know, on your dresser. But yeah, I got this, I believe, from Marshalls. And I don't remember the price, but it really is nice. And it keeps your perfumes in a nice, organized manner. I am going to have to find something a little bigger, though, because I am running out of room. But yeah, that's pretty much all of my perfumes. Please let me know if you guys have any of these. And I will see you guys next time.